Welcome to the support videos for Control M workload automation. In this video, we will show you how to discover a Control M for ZOS server in Control M Configuration Manager. Let's take a quick look at the requirements before we can discover a Control M for ZOS server in Control M Configuration Manager. First, in your ZOS system, IOA gate needs to be started, and that IOA gate started task must be starting the CTMCAS started task. And of course, the CTMCAS started task should be up and running. Now that we know our, what our COS requirements are, let's go ahead and go to our ZOS system, log on to TSO, go to SDSF where our started tasks are. As you can see, we have two IOA gate started tasks here. IOA gate M is for our regular Control M application server. And IOA gate C starts our Control M configuration application server. If we do a question mark on it, we, we can look at the AIA G log and we can see the parameters that is defined for our IOA gate C. So this is our gateway and we are using channel ID C1 for our, our configuration application server started task make note of the port that we're using for it and this is our started task ctmcas let's swapping our screen and we can see that our ctma cas started task is up and running now that we know we have our requirements satisfied in zos Let's go ahead and discover our Control M for ZOS server in Control M Configuration Manager. Let's click on New, select Control M Server, and we are already set to discover. Click on OK. Let's put the Control M name. We will call this Control M Prod underscore ZOS. The, our host is CMB2, and if you remember, the port on our CTMCAS, it is 5020. And we can click on next. And that should go ahead and communicate with our CTMCAS. And as you can see, we were able to retrieve our control M server parameters. Just click on next. And all the information of our control M for ZOS server is here. And Finish should have our Control M for ZOS defined in our Control M configuration manager. That concludes this Control M solutions video. Thank you for watching. Please check our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.